Hey, how's it going everybody? My name is Jake and today we're going to be talking about how to torrent files on your Mac. Torrenting is when you upload or download files through the BitTorrent network. It's a unique system in that it's peer to peer. And what that means is when you're downloading a file, somebody else is currently uploading it so that you can download it. And when you're uploading the file, you're uploading it directly to somebody else's download. People who upload are referred to as seeders and people who download are referred to as leechers. Now, the more seeders there are, the faster the leechers can download the file. So when you go to download a torrent file, you just want to make sure that there are enough seeders so that you can download the file quickly. And I'll just touch on this briefly. Torrenting is often associated with piracy because many people use it to download copyrighted movies and music. However, the act of torrenting is actually completely legal when using it for non-copyrighted file transfers. When torrenting, just be careful what you download and make sure you're not breaking any copyright or piracy laws. Now, in order to download a torrent file, you're going to need a torrent client. Some of the most popular ones are Transmission, Qubit Torrent, and Deluge but my personal favorite is Folks. The three options I just mentioned that weren't Folks are all great options. They are all open source, lightweight torrent clients that accomplish all of the basics you would want in a torrent client. But Folks has a few features that really separate it from the pack and make it the best option. And if you stick around to the end of this video, we are giving away an exclusive discount of 15% off Folks Pro, so definitely continue to watch till the end. Now in regards to folks, a separating feature for me is the ability to search for clients directly within the app. Just head up to the search bar and type in what you're looking for. There's no need to go to a specific website to find the torrents that you need. Folks also has one of the best organization systems out there. Every download you have is tagged and organized into specific areas based on those tags. So you can find everything very easily. Folks also allows you to create torrent files quite easily so you can share your files with other people. In order to create a torrent file, go to File, Create Torrent File. From there, you will need to select the source file and then add a tracker to it. You can grab a tracker by going to Google and searching for a public or a private torrent tracker to use. Then just give the file a name for the people who are downloading it and you can leave the save to and piece size to automatic. Click OK and now you can open the track of your choice and upload your newly created torrent file to share with others. Now if you really want to get the most out of Folks, you should definitely check out Folks Pro. It really does offer some great quality of life features like scheduling your downloads, saving your logins and passwords for FTP and HTTP websites, and it even gives you a YouTube to MP3 and a YouTube video downloader. Now, all of those are pretty great features, but I gotta say that my favorite is actually the integration that it has with Apple's music app. You can actually tell folks to automatically transfer any music or videos that you download directly into the music app. It can actually be a huge pain when you're downloading music and videos and you're trying to find it in Finder, and it can just cause you trouble. Now you can just automatically have it transferred directly into the music app. It's just a really nice feature to have and it completely reduces the friction of getting your downloaded music or videos directly into the music app. So you've made it to the end of this video. Congratulations. And as promised, we have that 15% discount code right about there. Uh, definitely go check out Folks Pro. It has some great features if you're looking to torrent files. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, be sure to give it a thumbs up and subscribe for more videos just like this. Thank you guys for watching and have a great rest of your day.